Am I the A for telling my in-laws it was on them to explain to their guests why there weren't any places for them at my wedding reception? I think the title has all the information. I married my husband last weekend after about a year of planning. The ceremony went off perfectly, even with kids in the church. The formal photos weren't delayed. No one got drunk and wrecked anything. No one insisted on bringing their emotional support goat. The only hitch was that my in-laws invited about 10 extra people without telling us. Not relatives or anything, just friends of theirs we did not invite since we don't know them. I did not notice them at the ceremony, and it wasn't until the reception that there were issues. There was no seating for them. Our best man and groomsman found a folding table and chairs for them to sit at. There was food. We went with a buffet. But since they sent the tables to eat by number, and they didn't have a number, they were sent last after everything had been picked over. My in-laws were embarrassed that their friends were being treated that way. I, very politely, asked them what they expected when they invited people without telling the people planning and paying for the wedding. They said we need to go apologize for their treatment. I said I would, but I would also explain that they had not actually been invited. If they wanted their guests told anything else, then they had to go explain. They were upset with me. My husband has my back 100%. I think I could have been more gracious, but I also think it should not have fallen on us to deal with it. Now for the comments. Your in-laws are, of course, entirely out of line and are the a-hoes here. But the people they invited are also a-hoes for even showing up. They did not receive an actual invite. Is this their first day on earth? Do they not know how weddings work? They didn't think it was odd that their invitation was a verbal one from the groom's parents and not a physical paper one sent in the mail by the couple? Not the A. Not the A. Not only did they invite 10 strangers, but you need to drop everything during your wedding reception. It's not like you're stressed or doing anything else. And apologize to these freeloaders that they had to go to the buffet line last. Nope. You should think about inviting strangers over to their house next time they have a gathering. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.